What's up, everybody? Crypto Muscle coming to you with another YouTube video. As you can see, it's the Crypto Muscle channel. All right, the Crypto Muscle Network. And my layout of all the different episodes that I produce on the daily. All right. And look at this. This is episode 2718. You know why? Because I've been cranking out two to four videos a day since July 2019. All right. On the daily. Seven days a week. 15 minute, two second videos. Two to four videos a day. And this one says no views private because it just hasn't been released yet. So you guys a little you guys got a little sneak peek at this particular video. All right, the wrecked collaboration dashboard dreams. All right. And the purpose of this video is uh it was a great suggestion by none other than the legendary Oracle himself. All right? And uh I mean, I couldn't have thought of a better video to put together than this, all right? And this is this video is about how do I make crypto daily, all right? And, you know, everybody has their ways of making it daily, you know, or weekly or monthly, however they go about doing it. Some people like to go into DeFi and pick certain coins, or some people like to do pump and dumps of them, right? Some people like to do trading, like Oracle... For example, likes to do a lot of trading. You know, that's that's his uh, forte. You know, he's a big time trader. He emphasizes that over all else. All right, and platforms is more of a bonus for him. You know, just to throw some money in and get some more money out. And he's very good at that too. But he's more of a trader in terms of leverage trading on the one minute chart. So me. I like to do a little bit of everything, uh, but I'm more into the platforms of this space and how do I go about doing it, right? So, uh, for example, in every one of my videos, all right, you go to show more. And if it says so, click on show more, all right, on every episode I have. And it drops down. I even show the Oracle's channel here on War on the One Minute, how, how that works. And to me, it's, a, it's one of the more effective ways of trading. And uh, and I'm good with that. I, I, that's the only method I've always learned how to trade. Wanted to learn how to trade. I got to experience that. And you know what? I don't do enough of that. So that's something I got to do for myself. But that's another thing that I do on a, on a daily as well in terms of as a whole, in making crypto daily, I do a little bit of trading, a little bit of coins, but other than that, I'm straight up about platforms. So, I mean, when you look at what I'm in right now, these are the current current platforms I'm in or stuff I'm utilizing, the activities I'm in. So, um, let's just get straight to it, right? So, by the way, my where it says you're following, subscribe to my BitChute exclusive content. Uh, this is going to be moving to a new channel on YouTube. I actually have it. I just haven't turned it on. It's more of a backup channel right now, but, uh, that's going to be my new, uh, podcast slash live stream channel. All right. Now I'll be coming, uh, the telegram channel right here. If you want to check out telegram, my telegram group, you know, we talk about platforms, we introduce platforms. Sometimes people throw some good ones up in there and it's like, oh shit. Okay. I'll check that out, you know, and things like that. How to get started in crypto, Coinbase, right? This is where you can buy and sell. It's the easiest way to get it, all right? Bit refill, I already talked about that. Um, if you want to make use of crypto in a good way and avoid the, the taxes and all that stuff that you get ooh, screwed on, this is the way to go about it. Convert crypto into gift cards. All right, let's just keep it moving here. So here's coins, all right? This is not something I make on the daily, but... These are more like, you know, typically the coins I pick are more of a long-term play um, in, instead of like a pump and dump type stuff that a lot of things are happening right now out there in YouTube. A lot of YouTubers do that. Uh, a lot of people do that. So this is the long-term play, all right? So the coins. So I won't go into that too much because this is talking about crypto on the daily. Now, this is the areas of the platforms I talk about, all right? 
passive income platforms, matrix, high yield, and mid levels, all right? So, what I like to do is there's seven days a week, right? You know, Sunday through Saturday. And I like to spread it out, all right? I, I got, a, you know, a few legacies that I, I coin as legacies. Um, you want to sprinkle some high yields. You want to sprinkle some uh, mid-level platforms and spread those out as well. So, what I like to do is I got my legacies in play right now. And I just happen to just fall in place. So, Medify Yielders. The way it's been playing out, it's like, all right, I just do them on Sunday, all right? And pay money is, is on Saturdays because that's just the day they pay his pay money is on Saturday. So Medify Yielders, um, they earn money through Friday, but you can withdraw any day as long as you have the minimum. So I just withdraw on Sundays, and I do Sundays and Wednesdays with them. Uh, cause there's so much going on with Medify Yielders. I do twice a week. If there's so much activity and so much stuff going on, I like to do at least twice a week videos or even more, just depending on the platform. Keep it live. I think I was doing, oh, I, I was doing at least two a week back then. So that's an example. Cash of X at one point I was doing two a week. So you get what I'm saying. Pay money is on Saturdays. Pegasus. Uh, there's a lot of good activity going on with Pegasus so much that I do them Mondays and Thursdays. And then M and &E FX, uh, I just did one on Tuesday. I want to I want to move them to Fridays. Gam, um, they only pay out Monday through Friday, so I'm gonna put them on Tuesday. See, so you see how I have something nearly every day spread out. Uh, Saphir's and I put it here, but uh, this is more of a long term play on that one with their hub and all that stuff. So I just put it here. Um. And then when you have high yield platforms, I like to check them every other day or so, or every two days max on them. So that's what I like to do with high yield platforms. So I did a high yield platform update yesterday. I believe it was yesterday. Uh, no, wait, uh, Friday. So more than likely I'll do an update either later on today or even Monday. So we'll see. So that's how that works for me because hypes, you constantly want to check those because they're high yield platforms, yes, but they could go away quickly. So I like to check them every other day or every two days or so. Uh, some people like to check them every day, which is fine too. And now you have mid-level platforms, right? Again, it just depends, um, you know, what what's going on with them. Uh, Elevate Pass pays out every Wednesday. So I always like to do a Wednesday night withdrawal and put out a video Thursday. Atiora and Mido, I've been with them for so long. I've been pretty much doing either Monday or Tuesday videos on these two platforms, uh, just because um, it just depends uh, if how much earnings are in it. And if it looks like on the low end, I'll give it an extra day or two, and then um, I'll do it like on a, you know, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, whatever. All right, Pay Mirror, I tend to do them on Mondays. I don't know. I just tend to do them on Mondays. And COTP. Uh, I haven't done enough videos on this. Um, there's a long story about, and it, it, it's nothing bad. It's just my bad, as in uh, I'm in, I'm trying to transition to a new computer, so I haven't been able to run the COTP um, until I get to my new computer. So that won't be till later on this week. So that's what I'm waiting on right now. So that's COTP, Beyond Wise, and Celix. Those kind of round out uh, towards the uh, middle to the end of the week for me. And so you see how there's something going on every day, right? I got something every day. Uh, Team Build Club, that's kind of a, it, it all depends, right? Uh, I haven't checked in on that recently. Um, that's more of a long-term kind of play. Daisy, that's a super long-term play. Um, but Matrix, you can't expect a lot out of Matrix platforms just because uh, the emphasization of spillover is highly, highly overrated. And the thing about it is, is that once the spillover, you know, comes, they come in spurts, literally, and then they don't come, right? And it's all about uh, how much you could share that link out there. For me, 
Uh, the only positive spin about it is they do trading. They don't. It's not just solely on uh, matrix spillovers or anything like that. Um, so they do trading to help increase what you have within them. So that's why I'm going to eventually spin myself out of these matrix platforms because I'm kind of just over how it is and how they are and uh in general right and i'm all about just smashing them now and that's what i've been doing right if you've been seeing my videos lately on some of these other platforms um team build club i'm holding on to them just because like i said it's a long-term play they they go into projects free marketing all that stuff it's actually not bad um so every day i'm pulling out money from somewhere so i got a little bit of long-term plays with these coins right I got a uh, long-term play with the, with these sort of matrix because other than, other than that, I don't do any sort of like staking, ladder staking, none of that stuff, right? Well, actually, I do staking, but it's a long story on that one too. That's just on mint coin. I don't know if you guys heard of mint coin. That's a, a 20, for me, that was like a 2017, 2018 thing. And uh, I'll probably have to just show that to you guys one day when I'm talking about with mint coin uh, that's the only literally the only staking I really do but I haven't done that in so long uh, but I'm not into the whole you know ladder staking for five years and ten years and all that other garbage that some of these youtubers do with some of these coins because some of these things won't be around when you you know decide to cancel it or withdraw your staking and try to convert to earnings and all that and then what right crypto is so short term it's all about what can they do for me now you know what can they do for me now and that's how you got to look at it like all this stuff i look at it uh you know as a week to week thing because any one of these could go at any time right and that's the thing about it um you know it's just the way it is and you got to have that mindset that you can't think that, oh shit, as great as Medify Yielders is, you can't just say, oh man, I can't wait. I'm going to be earning this much in a year and all that. No, you can't be thinking like that. You just got to just take it a week at a time, literally, you know, because it might not be around next week. You just don't know. That's the thing about crypto is you don't know with any of these platforms, all right? It's nice to say, hey, you know, oh man, this is great. This is going to last a year for me and Oh man, I'll have a nice savings account and all this. No, we, we just can't think like that. You know, we, we just got to just take. Oh, and by the way, compounding is so bullshit. Do not compound, all right? Compounding is allowing these guys that run these platforms, all right, to hold on to that money to pay someone else. Uh, that's how compounding is. Compounding is for dashboard dreams and dashboard wannabes because. The thing about it is it kills you, all right? It kills YouTubers, it kills Tiwi, right? And all these idiots out there that think that compounding is going to make you a lot of money. Yes, it looks good on the dashboard, right? It looks good on paper, but in the end, these platforms don't last long enough for you to, to take it into fruition. And so take the money whenever you can. All right, that's how it works with this, you know, in the crypto game. Always take the money. Do not compound. The compound is, is so bullshit. It's so it's just for idiots with dashboard dreams, like I said, that you're you're really just screwing yourself over. So anytime you see the money, you take it. All right, and maybe, all right, if you're whole and you feel like you want to throw a little bit more to, towards compound. All right, maybe. But other than that, screw that shit. You take the money every time because that's how it is. So every so every day, I got something I'm taking out every day, whether it's hypes. doesn't matter if it's only like 10 bucks or 20 bucks, whatever, right? It could be thousands of dollars. It could be just uh, 50 bucks. I mean, whatever it is, I'm taking something out every day. That's the whole idea. So it looks like a lot, but at the same time, it's really not a lot of platforms. And... That's the way I go about doing it. That's how I go about earning daily. And that's how I've been succeeding on the Crypto Muscle Network. And you could probably do the same too, right? It's all about how you put it together and, and put 
yourself in action. So that's how you go about it. Hit me up if you have any questions or comments, and I'll see you in the next one.